Hello learners, we are going to review some math facts songs because math facts are very important because they make everything else quicker in your math, especially as you get up into the upper grades. Being able to recall your math facts is really important. I'm sorry my dog just shook her collar. Sophie, thank you for that. Anyways, so I'm going to review our math facts songs. They don't go through all of our math facts, all the way up to 12 necessarily, but they get you a good foundation and they're just a good thing to jog your memory. I learned them in sixth grade from my sixth grade teacher and to this day sometimes I still sing them in my head. More than sometimes if I'm being completely honest. So we're going to review them. I am in no way attempting to be a famous YouTube teacher slash singer, so please bear with me on my singing voice, um, but we're just going to review them. They go to nursery rhymes, so first we will start with our threes. It goes... 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30, then comes 33. Then we will go to our fours. 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28, 32, 36, 40, then comes 44. Moving on. We don't do one for fives because hopefully we can skip count by our fives. So we move up to six. Sixes is more of a call and response, so I'm hoping that you from home will respond back to me or else it's not quite as fun. Okay, so it goes 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36, 42, 48, 54, 60, 66, and those are our sixes. Next, move on. we move on to our sevens. I have to adjust my camera a little bit because I have to get my hands ready to clap. I don't know if I'm going to be able to. If only Sophie could clap, it would make this easier. So it goes 7, 14, 21, 28, 35, 42, 49, 56, 63, 70. Look at me, I got the sevens in my head and that is great. Moving on. We move up to our eights. Eights, we have... <clears throat> 8, 16, 24, 32, 40, 48, 56, 64, 72. And then move on to our nines. Now, nines, you got to stay with me because it gets a little quick and then a little slow. So we got to stay together on this one. Nines goes 9, 18, 27, 36, 45, 54, 63, 72, 81, 90. It gets kind of quick at the end. And then this, the 12 song. We don't have one for 10s because skip counting my 10s, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. 11s, haven't come up with one yet for, but one of my great students, Mr. AJ, came up with a 12 song. Now, AJ, I'm sorry if I mess up the exact melody. All I know is it goes to I Want It That Way by the Backstreet Boys. I'm used to AJ leading it, so I'm going to do my best. 12, 24, 36, 48, 60, 72, 84, 96, 108. I think I messed it up. Let me do that one again. 12, 24, 36, 48, 60, 72, 84, and 96, 108. I'm really sorry if I messed it up. I know I didn't mess the math up. I might have messed the melody up, uh, but we'll get that back together once we get back to school. I'll have AJ perform it, and we'll pull it together. So those are your math facts songs. You can come back to this um, to practice it. It just helps stay in your head with those nursery rhymes singing along to them. Um, if you only need to practice maybe your sixes, then skip ahead to that part in the video, so on and so forth. Um, but remember, math facts are very important. Um, makes everything else quicker. It's great to know them as quickly as you can, so you can use this time at home to practice those math facts. You could even make some flashcards if you want, if you have index cards or scrap paper laying around, and you can quiz yourself with them, okay? So learners, until next time, this is Miss G. See you soon.